genuine powerful value has to be created inside that community through a repository of intellectual property and the caliber of people that are attracted to this community. So if this is the community that has peer mind, peer level mindset, my peers are in that community where I can comfortably share my concern, best practices and hear what others are saying, that will be the first point that will attract the initial um, interest for people to engage in such community. The second, as I mentioned earlier, powerful intellectual property that hopefully is the only place where it resides and nowhere else can I find such intellectual property. And then there's a lot of other things that can be done. For example, how do you market the community to the people? Uh, to get such a community, such as the example we've done for Ellen, uh, Ellen's Forms, which is, I believe, if not the best, one of the best communities out there, uh, requires strong brand. So the person who is involved there has to have a powerful, strong brand to attract the people to them. Once the brand is there and once the attraction of the community, of the people or members to come to the community, uh, when we first launched the community, we just got a little bit of people participating. And in order to increase that, we've done a lot of things behind the scenes to attract them to participate more. So for example, um, I would write, let's say if you commented on the forum, I would write, Andrew, this is a great point, love your participation, would love to hear more from you. Uh, if I disagree, I would say, you know, I, I would challenge your thinking a little bit. And it may be either on the forum itself, or I would send you a private email and say, um, you know, I'm interested in what you said, I have a different viewpoint, I'm interested in your, how you would defend that, and would it would hopefully entice you to come back and defend your position. Uh, so both the great job or provocatively challenging your thoughts would attract people to come back. Um, the other things that I've done uh, behind the scenes, if you did not participate for a while, I would send you a note and say, Andrew, I haven't seen you here for a while, would love to see you back. So little things like that, those are just some of the few that um, to do that are critical to create a thriving community. Once that momentum, once that, uh, uh, once that point reaches where people are starting to participate heavily, it's just an amazing phenomenon to watch because it takes on a life of its own. People are there, people want to be part of this community, and then I'm not worried about its future. It's the initial commitment, it's the initial way to attract people that is so critical.